Take a deep breath in, out, in, and out. And once more, in and out. And see yourself sitting here within your rooms. And we're going to reach down through the ground. So grow the roots out from your feet, down through the floor, down through any basement that's there, and into the ground, into the soil. And reach down around the pebbles and go down around the boulders through this moist soil, deep within the earth. Go down until you reach the bedrock far, far below you and feel around this bedrock until you find a pool of cool, cold water far beneath the earth. We're going to draw this water up into our bodies. So we draw it up through our roots and bring them up into our feet and into our calves. Feel the waters come up into our legs and into our bellies. As with each and every breath, bring the water further up into our chest, into our head, and out through our hands and back into the earth. Feel the waters from far below coming up throughout and returning back below through our bodies. Then we're going to reach up with our arms, grow branches up through the roofs, up into the sky. We're going to search for that one lone star far above our heads. And as we reach up, we'll pull down that light from above, the fires from above, and bring this into our hands and into our heads. Bring this light, bring this fire into our chests and into our bellies. With each and every breath, bring this light further down into our legs and into our feet. Feel this fire from above mixing with this water from below. The energies of order and chaos mixing throughout our bodies, filling us with the energies that they both bring. Fire and water, order, chaos. Rejoice in this energy. Fill yourself with this energy. But for now, we're going to keep only what we need. And when you have that, push the fires back up to the heavens, push the waters back down to the earth. But know that at any time when you need these powers, when you need this energy, you can reach down and reach up and bring them within you whenever and however you need them. But for now, take a deep breath in and out, in and out. And when you're ready, join us. So first, we make offerings to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you who surround us, support us, Give us this wonderful weather. Give us all this food that sustains us. Earth Mother, without you here, we would not be surviving. And you surely do make our lives interesting with the weather that you do provide. So Earth Mother, for all you do, accept our offerings. Earth Mother, accept our offerings. <sighs> We are here to honor the gods. We are here to ask their blessings in return. But first, we recreate our cosmos. Mighty well, you reach deep into the earth and you connect us to the ancestors far below. We give you the silver and we ask sacred waters flow within us. Sacred waters flow within us. In mighty fire, you burn and transform. You send our offerings up into the heavens, up to the gods. We offer you this incense. 
We say sacred fire burn within us. Sacred fire burn within us. And mighty tree, your roots go deep into the ground, to the realms of the ancestor. And your branches go high into the sky, to the realms of the shining ones. We ask that you are a pathway between all the worlds and the center of our world. Sacred tree, grow within us. Sacred tree, grow within us. And in each and every one of our homes, by the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. <sighs> now we call on the gatekeepers. Gatekeepers all, you have aided us in the many, many rites that we have done throughout the years. We call on you to aid us once more, to take our words far and wide, and to bring back what we need to hear. Watch over us and protect us as we walk your holy ways. And guide us with where to go and whom to speak to. Gatekeepers all, accept our offerings. Gatekeepers all, accept our offerings. And gatekeepers, as you join your magic with mine, and in my house and in all of our houses, let the well open as a gate to the underworlds. Fire open as a gate to the upper worlds. And let the tree be the crossroads between all the worlds, open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Let the gates be opened. And shining ones, gods and goddesses of elder days, you who look over each and every one of us, our patrons, our matrons, you who look over all of us but are unknown to us, and you of this very land where we are, to each and all of you, come. Join us at our fire. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Shining ones, accept our offerings. And the land spirits, fur and feather, scale and skin, leaf and twig, stem and flower, our animal and our plant kin. And to all the unseen, the fae, older folk, and what other many names that you go by. Come, join us at our fire. Land spirits, accept our offerings. Land spirits, accept our offerings. And the ancestors, you have walked this earth before us. Our relatives, you of our chosen family, our heroes, and you buried within this ground. To each and every one of you, we offer you welcome. And come, join us at our fire. Ancestors, accept our offerings. Ancestors, accept our offerings. At this point, if you have offerings you wish to make, please make them now. As I've been asking for a few weeks now, may calmer, cooler heads prevail. There are no further offerings. The ancient and mighty ones we give to you 
and we ask that we receive blessings in return. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. And so, what blessings do we receive? Shining ones, what blessings do you give us? They give us Burkana, new beginnings, the birch. Land spirits, what blessings do you give us? Give us Elhas. The elk and elk sesh, protection. And ancestors, what blessings do you give us? They give us Awas, the horse, spiritual travel. Well, I'm reading this as we've got the protection we need to start something new, especially starting something new spiritually. I think this omen is good. Do we accept this omen? We accept this omen. Okay. Mighty kindred, we have given to you in good gossipy fashion a gift calls for a gift. Fill these waters, fill these waters in all of our homes. Fill them with Burkano and new beginnings. Fill them with El Ewas, sorry, Elhas, uh, the elk and protection. Fill them with Ewas, the horse, the spiritual journey work. Behold the waters of life. Behold the waters of life. And now as if I have a cat that's interested in the smoke of the incense. <laughs> we thank all who have aided us today. Ancestors, each and every one of you that have aided us tonight, be you family, be you friends and heroes, or be you of this place. Ancestors, we thank you. Ancestors, we thank you. And land spirits, you fur and feather, scale and skin, leaf and twig, stem and flower, all the seen and unseen ancestors, for all of you that have aided us tonight, not ancestors, land spirits, for all of you that have aided us tonight, land spirits, we thank you. Land spirits, we thank you. <laughs> It's shining ones, gods and goddesses in all their days, be you our patrons and matrons, be you of this very land, or be you unknown to us. From all that you, all that have combinated us today, shining ones, we thank you. Shining one, we thank you. And gatekeeper. You have opened the waves and brought back these wonderful omens for all that you have done for us, gatekeeper. We thank you. Gatekeeper, we thank you. And we ask that you once more join your magic with mine in my house and in all of our houses. Let the well become but water once more. Let the fire become but flame once more. Let the tree become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. Let the gates be closed. And Earth Mother, we honor you first and we honor you last. Without you, we would not be here. Without you, the, well, no food, no weather, you know, no place to live. For all that you do for us, the least we can do is remember you every day within our lives. But 
for now. Earth Mother, we thank you. Earth Mother, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace, for the right has ended.